I kind of worked on the statistical methods, and then um, I, I was very lucky at, uh, early on in my career to have some great collaborators, and some, some work that I did with uh, Ken Singleton started getting a lot of attention, and, uh, and I guess at that point in time was the first time I had a, some feeling that this was a, a, an important research agenda. And um, maybe it was 1985 when Ken Singleton and I were given the Frisch Prize. Ragnar Frisch was the first um, Nobel laureate in economics, and so the Econometric Society has this prize called the Frisch Prize. And so at a fairly young age, I was, I was able to share that. I guess that was an indicator that the work was getting some attention. I remember being very much kind of enthusiastic and, and, and excited by the research, but it was very hard to tell that how, you know, which portions of the research were going to command the biggest attention. In fact, it, even now when I work on research projects, um, you know, sometimes they get very little attention and sometimes they get a lot, and, I'm not, and while I'm doing it, it's not always so easy to tell <laughs> which, which are the ones that will have the bigger influence.